Right, this uh, clock, I've deliberately set the pendulum out of beat. There should be an even tick-tock on the central vertical line when it's, when it's at rest. So I'm going to start it up. So here you can hear there's a tick-tock, tick-tock, it's uneven. And what you would do here normally is just lift one side or other of the clock to see if it improves things. Now lifting the left there didn't help. I'm going to lift the right hand side of the clock now. And we have a more even tick-tock. If I lift it further, you'll hear again it becomes uneven. I'm lowering it down and we have an even tick-tock. And then if I put it down the pendulum stops. Now in the old days Granny would often put some pennies under this side of the clock on the right here to even up the, the beat. What we need to do is as I had to raise this side of the clock to make the beat even we need to push the crutch which is this piece at the back here we need to push this over to the side of the clock that we had to raise in this case it was the right hand side so I'm just gently giving it a little push, very gently. Oh, see it's moved. We let it run again and listen. It's still uneven. I'm going to lift the left hand side of the clock. Doesn't improve matters. If we lift the right hand side of the clock, it improves it. So now we know that we still need to push it a little bit further to the right. See the crutch at the back there that I'm pushing? Still not that even. Lift the left, the right rather. And now lift the left. Now that's the even beat. I've had to lift the left hand side to achieve that. So I've obviously pushed it a bit too far. So again, finger on the crutch at the back. Just push it a tiny little bit. Excuse the colour of my finger, I've been polishing. A little bit until it gives. And lo and behold, an even tick-tock, which shows it's now in beat and it's not going to stop on you. If I lift the left hand side, it stops. If I lift the right hand side, it stops. But away in the middle there, it's going to run forever. <laughs>